I didn't do it. I swear I didn't do it. Now, good day, Jaden. I've got nothing to do with that business. I never killed nobody. Oh, no. Then why did you run away when ah, they sorry. came to question you? You're interviewing the suspect. I already told you. I forgot to report to my parole officer. Yeah, local story. I didn't want to go back to prison. When I saw the cops, I just bolted. I wasn't thinking straight. We checked out his statement. He has an alibi for at least three of the murders. Oh, well, thanks a lot there. Oh, blight, but... Oh, that bastard was a perfect fit. Shit! Who's this? No luck then, Jaden. Oh, uh, great. No leads. Okay. No clue. No beer. Sean Moss's mother is here. She'd like to speak with you. What did you say? Sean Moss's mother's here? Where, where's she been? It was a few months back. What was? The middle of the night. It was pouring down. Jaden, what's going on? Ethan came home completely drenched at about three. I asked so? Him where he'd been. We had a drink. He uh he spoke about drowning the rain. Um he didn't make any sense. Well, that's what happens, Jay. You have a drink? Something. Something in his eyes. As if it wasn't really him. Oh, oh hold on a second. Jake! There Jake? Was no connection. Blake! Whatever your name is. The next day there was that announcement about another victim. You never had a drink before? Of the origami killer. Well, then you know what I'm talking about. Find my son. I'm begging you. It's you, isn't it? It's you. Whoa, hold on, hold on. Let's not go to that next suspect just yet. I'm Police Lieutenant Carter Blake. This is Agent Norman Jaden. Jaden, I'm telling you. According to our information, you got the wrong man. Your patience. I'd like to ask you a few questions about him. I'm no. sorry, that's impossible. I beg your pardon? I'm bound by an oath of secrecy. Jason! Under no circumstances I know he looks may bad, I but... discuss my patience. What? My job is to find Sean Mars alive, and I don't give a damn about any bullshit oath. Oh, no. I know you don't want to protect the murderer. If you know anything, you must tell us, Doctor. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Uh, now I must ask you to leave. You need to cooperate. For your own sake. Easy, Blake. Just chill out a little bit. Let the man speak. Doctor, a child's life's at stake. You may know something that could help us save him. Are you threatening me? I'm just giving no. you some free no. advice, Doc. Not at all. I what are you on about? Take it. Blake, that's enough. Let's get out of here. Yeah, calm down, Blake. I'm going to call the police God's and sake. make a complaint about your behavior. What? Don't, don't, you are... don't just push me out the way, Blake. The only thing I'm interested in is saving that kid's life. So you're gonna be a good boy. What are you doing? Get off him, Blake. Know, you're I'm out of control. Really gonna lose Blake, my temper back. immediately. Blake, I'm gonna backhand Blake, you. Go Stop it. You were... Put your hand down, Jaden. There's no Blake. need for. <laughs> Cross to Mori. What's wrong with you? You lose cannon. Lose cannon. What? Blake! Put the man down! What are you doing, Blake? You idiot! You okay, Doc? What the? Come on, Doc. There's an easy way and a hard way. It's your fucking Jayden, choice. Jaden, don't just stand there. We've got to do something. If you don't let go of this man immediately, I'll report you and you'll be off the case. Oh, that's good, Jaden. What the hell's the matter with you, Norman? Were you getting cold feet? You don't want to save Sean Mars anymore? I want to save Sean Mars just as much as you do, but that doesn't give me all rights. So you're going to stop this shit right now. Right now. You idiot. Ethan Mars has had psychological problems since his first son died. Doctor. He feels responsible for his death. Don't do this. A sort of morbid neurosis. He is haunted by visions of drowning bodies. Who? A few weeks ago. Who said that? After one of our usual sessions, I found this on the floor. What? He must have fallen out of his pocket. Oh, well, that's convenient, wouldn't you say? I don't remember having that. You son of a... Frog! <sighs> Jaden, listen to me. No, not just listen. Just listen. I know it looks bad, but think. This doesn't make sense. Don't listen to Blake, he's an idiot. Just... 
Just listen. Where are we going now? Ash, I want you to assign every available man to finding Ethan Mars. I want what? outside his place day and night. Notify all agencies to start looking for him. I want you no. to keep an eye on the train stations, the airports, the bus terminals. I want every cop in the city on his ass. So that if he moves, we know about it. Oh, no. Yes. Ethan Mars is the origami killer. No, you're incorrect. Negative. That is incorrect. I've got to warn Ethan. See you around.